<clears throat> Y'all about to see it all, cause my voice usually don't activate until mm, about an hour after I get up. Especially living alone, because who am I talking to? But good morning. I am late. Okay, I'm not late yet. I'm behind. Mm. I would typically get up at 5:30. It's currently like 6:50. I didn't just get up. I've been up for a minute. But um, I didn't get up at 5.30. So now I have to put things into like turbo mode to get out. And sometimes this happens, you know. Some days I'm on it and I'm up and I'm just killing it. And there's days like today where I got it late last night because I have like a 10 o'clock, a class that gets out at 10 o'clock. So when I come home, sometimes I just want to like breathe for a second. And I breathed a little too long last night. <laughs> So I didn't feel like getting up with my alarm, but um, but yeah, so let me be quiet and go do what I need to do. And yeah. So while I look like a crazy person and let this settle into my face, I am going to try to find something to wear. <laughs> you guys are probably like, what the heck? Yeah, I know. I really need to be leaving in like no later than 15 minutes. I really need to ask Siri what the weather is, but I'm using my phone. Even though you guys know like with fall, it's literally such a scandal because it's freezing in the morning like when you leave and then by like noon you're sweating and whatever you decide to put on because it was freezing in the morning because it's now 90,000 degrees it's such a scam oh I do have Siri on my Mac I've never used it here we go what's the weather today okay here's the weather for today okay okay that's tight the high is 79 it's currently 71 low of 52 oh it's currently 71 okay oh, okay guys let me focus for real i gotta find something to wear <laughs> chill today I don't have any meetings I don't have to go to work I don't really have to do anything but go to class and like I have like a break in between my two classes where in the beginning of the semester I used that time to take a nap <laughs> but now I, I pretty much use that as like a little study time especially because I have a midterm on Tuesday oh lord um but anywho I like having y'all with me this is gonna be fun I went makeup free this morning. You can't really tell because it's still dark outside. And actually, typically when I leave around like 6.45, 7, it's like pitch black outside. Like, what the heck? A life hack about um, not wearing makeup is to throw on some glass. I don't know if I like this, though, today. Mm, I don't know. These glasses are so... They're just so large and in charge. Like, what are you doing? But for the record, you guys know I don't wear glasses. These are not prescription. No glasses you ever see on my face are prescription. They're not. I'd be out here stunting because I just like glasses. And I feel so bad because people with glasses will come to me and say something real deep about like having a bonding moment about glasses and contacts. And I just be like, sis, I can't relate. I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> This is not real. It's a lie. I just like having things on my face that look pretty. Oh, which funny story, I actually might need glasses these days. I had 20-20 vision, like, all of my life. But I think stress from school and stuff and, like, sitting in front of the computer for an ungodly amount of hours and all that might have affected my eyesight a little bit. It's not, like, bad enough to go run to the doctor's office, but sometimes it's a little... A little tough to see, but but yeah, for now. Oh, dang, 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 dang. Oh, slow pokes. Sorry, guys. This is also another light that just takes just a little too long. And actually, this expressway on the way to school is trifling, it's usually packed. So, y'all just pray, extend your hands that you know, even though I left late, I still make it 
at a decent hour. Most days, I probably won't be able to really record a lot at school. Because <laughs> so I just, I do stuff. Oh, you know you wrong. I'm dead. You did not have the right away, Babuski. But I love Jesus, so I'm not going to, you know, do anything crazy to you. I will talk to you guys later after my 8 a.m. class. I have been out of class for hours now. Now I'm headed to class number two. It's actually lab for my Univary research course. You know how you just like, you're looking at a professor while they're talking and you're seeing like words happening and lips moving like you're attentive, you're focused, but there's no words registering in your brain. Yeah, that's that class. Um, I conceptually understand some things better than I thought I would, so I have to give myself some credit there. I did not eat breakfast this morning. Y'all, confession. I have not been buying groceries. Or I buy them, but they just stay like it's freezer stuff and it stays in the freezer. Like, I have not been cooking food a little bit, but not nearly as much. See, this is why sometimes it's better to be broke because when you get a little money then you start spending money on stuff you would have just never spent money on before like spending money on food has always been an issue but spending money like this on food I didn't have it so I had nowhere to spend it whereas now I'm doing the most y'all I'm doing the most I'm gonna fix that Let's try to fix that real soon <laughs> Another week of classes, Saints. I just finished my last class of the week. I just have to work tomorrow and some meetings tomorrow. And your girl is done for the weekend. You guys see I tried to be like homecoming festive today. It was actually really corny. But I tried because homecoming week is almost over. But I really came on here because the Holy Spirit is convicting me on the inside. Because I haven't been to the gym all week. And I even brought my... Hold on, evidence. My gym bag. I was prepared, but see what had happened was, I'm not feeling it. And so, my vow to you guys, like you can hear me or we'll see this, is that if I go home, I'll exercise at home. Now, I've said this before and it didn't happen. And I feel really guilty about it, but I'm going home. <laughs> funny story I was supposed to have been done with my hair I was recording a video I was supposed to be recording a tutorial <laughs> a band did not tutorial but what happened was like okay so I did not realize how much my hair has grown like y'all see this right like y'all see this so I blew it out and it like blew me back <laughs> Like, I had a photo shoot. <laughs> I've just done the most. And now my bedtime's in an hour. And I still haven't recorded this dang video. It won't take me long, but it's still just like... Then I'm stuck. Like, this blowout is so bomb. Like, I could style this so easily. Y'all see this? Y'all see the way this mug is laying? I could totally wear this as a hairstyle. Like, and I would probably scare some people at my job the first time but this is popping but i really need to record this tutorial because if i don't what the heck am i posting on saturday <laughs> i don't have no other content well i have something else in mind but not for this week so <sighs> i guess i gotta let it go and just do this daggone tutorial you know what else is funny so that exercise was trash 
<laughs> it was absolute trash.com, you guys, and I literally said I'm not doing that anymore. Like, if I ever tell you, obviously you can't stop me by the time you see the video, but if I ever say on here, like, oh, I'm gonna go home and exercise at home, don't believe me, don't listen to me, remind me of this moment. Okay? I mean, I go to the gym and burn 700 minimum. Like, I don't let myself leave until I burn 700. So, what was I doing? I was trying all these random videos on YouTube. I could not find the ones that I was used to doing. So the ones I was doing sucked. I hadn't worked out in a week. So my body was like, girl, you tried it. Especially because I ate that huge quesadilla from Kidoba for lunch. Like, who am I? Who are you? My body literally laughed at me. Like, I looked like a buffoon. And, like, I know y'all are already looking at it and probably laughed because it was a joke. So I'm not doing that anymore. I know I need to go to the gym. I need to stick to my routine and go to the gym. Yeah, guys. You know... I'm a hot mess, but I do want to shout out and say thank you to you guys today. I celebrated 700 subscribers. <laughs> oh my god! Well, I think it was technically yesterday. Okay, it was yesterday. <gasps> but yeah, so I made a post today though and shared with people like 700 followers, 44k views, and like y'all have been loving on that and supporting me, and I was just like, oh my god! And I got from shares, I, I think it was from sharing that I got 10 new subscribers today. Like what? Y'all are dope and this is going to be so fun. I'm so excited to be doing this with you guys. This is going to be an hour trillion long video and I'm so sorry. I just apologize. It's the first one. So just give me grace. Good morning. Good morning to you. The birds are chirping. I actually don't know what that song is about, so I probably shouldn't be singing it because I've heard it's not a good song. So why did I sing it? I don't know. Sorry, the windshield wipers are really noisy in the back. But happy Friday. It is Friday, guys. We made it through another week. I feel like this semester is flying by. I'm not going to be late for work, but I am not in good time to get a parking spot the ideal parking spot so I might have to park elsewhere and take the bus it's okay it's Friday I don't care it's a good day it's gonna be a great day there's a few things going on today I have a meeting um, at my practicum site which is exciting because it's my first meeting at the practicum site and I also have black caucus this evening black caucus is the um, basically student organization for grad students and professional students at Ohio State that are black. I did wake up and finish recording my um, hair tutorial on Bantu Knots. As you see, it's already starting to get fluffy like the dew in the morning. Gently resting upon my hair follicles and making my hair 12,000 times bigger than it was this morning. But that's okay because I actually like the frizz look with bantu knots i mean not like to the point where you can't tell they're bantu knots but you know it's good volume i don't know i like it so we're gonna go with it until it gets absolutely crazy and then i brought extra backup materials just in case this goes haywire y'all i am running like a crazy person i mean it's fine but today's been so good i got to visit um i'll explain my hair in a second um <laughs> I got to visit this school that I'll be working at, got to meet the teachers and everything, and I'm super excited, you guys, about my practical placement this year and doing research, which, like, who am I? Never thought I would say these words ever in life did I ever think I would say these words, but yeah, stuff is just real good. I don't know. Yeah, my Bantu not out literally went haywire. When I tell you, like, I mean, I'm used to it getting frizzy, but it was like, y'all, I looked like an accident like it just was trash and I still have meetings today I still have things to do there's an event tonight I was like I'm not going looking like this like this just doesn't represent me well so I had to run home the school is actually very close to my um, apartment which is amazing so I ran by my apartment because I left my debit card there and I don't want to be out and about at these events tonight without my debit card because no um absolutely not so I went in to grab that and I was like you know what let me just do something with this hair like I have a second literally a second because I'm supposed to be back at this school in eight minutes <gasps> oh god for another meeting but it's fine 
it's fine this is my life you can see i kind of enjoy it a little bit just a little bit but anyways so yeah i just um what i did was i brushed out the bantu knot to like go back to the blowout state kind of from last night it's not straight blowout like it was yesterday but it still gives like the blowout effect right so yeah i just brushed it out and then i slicked down my edges and just put a um not hair ties but uh what am i thinking about like the stretchy headbands i just doubled one up and like pushed it back so that my edges stay slick and so it's almost like a slick ponytail but the back is more of like a fro situation i don't know if i make any sense but yeah and you know you gotta lay the edges so in this little eight minute drive to school 10 minute drive potentially to school i was like let me put some extra lay on these edges and i just hope that they last <laughs> today can you tell max chilling i have been in pajamas all day happily what am i looking for first of all let me focus so i can remember what i'm doing this is what i want okay um yeah i've been max chilling but i've been productive i've been very productive i've gotten a lot of things done but i feel bad because <sighs> i was supposed to go tailgating today guys i was gonna have this whole nice little fun vlog of me tailgating for osu homecoming for the first year it didn't happen y'all it didn't happen and let me tell you why i am an introvert and i'm accepting it i'm embracing it i am yeah i don't get energy from being around people i do not i am a loner i'm a loner and last year i was a loner to the point where it was a problem this year I think I'm managing it well. Like, I very much have social relationships. I go do things. I go to events. You know, every once in a while, I put things on my schedule. Like, I'm out. I'm experiencing. But I still value being at home. Like, the turn-up life was never for me. And I didn't even turn up last night. Because I don't. That's not, that's not what I do, okay? <laughs> Let me just put that out there. I do not do that. That is not the lifestyle for me. Um, but even being out there in that atmosphere... I literally the whole time, it had nothing to do with the people that I was with, like cool, tight, all good. But I just, oh God, oh God. It was like every time it was like, we're going to go somewhere else. My insides were just like, no, <laughs> no. Like I was this close to having like somebody call me and say that somebody died so I could leave. That's so dramatic. But I just, oh my God, I had no, uh, last night just confirmed that for me. And so today to think about like going out and being around people. And I knew I had a lot of stuff I wanted to get done anyway. So it just, there was no way it was going to happen. Like I need to clean my apartment. Like you guys probably can't tell all the way, but I keep my apartment clean. Like I enjoy having a clean apartment. It makes me just feel really great. And so I need to clean. And this is like really crazy because the sun is going down. But I wanted to try to record my fall clothing haul. So I went and sold a bunch of stuff so I could afford a new like fall wardrobe and really just uh, reset my wardrobe overall. Like 
I just really am annoyed with a lot of my clothes. I've had them for years. And so I went ahead and like I said, sold a bunch of stuff and got enough money to basically replenish what I spent to purchase these things. Look at all this stuff, you guys. Oh my gosh, right? It came in that box over there. I know. It was so obnoxious. I'm like, this is so not me to be doing all this. But I'm excited. Um, so I wanna try to record like the try on haul today before the sun goes down, but I wanna clean first. I need to clean first, so. Enough yapping, let's get to cleaning. with you guys and confess that that is a pizza I went to Pizza Hut okay and there was a nice little online deal for a seven dollar large and that's what happened here's my excuse okay I cleaned my house and I cleaned my fridge and there's no food in there except for vegetables and rice and so here's my promise to you all I promise it'll be a better promise. All these promises. I promise that it will be a better promise than my exercise promise. This is the last day I'm doing this because I told you guys already sometime early in the week that I have to do better with spending money on food. I don't know why this keeps happening. I got a paycheck and a job and I lost my freaking mind. So I need to go back to meal prepping like I was doing and being consistent. And so tomorrow, I'm taking you guys to the grocery store. I'm gonna show you that I really am about this meal prep life and I'm gonna get back to it. You won't see that on this vlog, but we'll be grocery shopping on the next vlog, i.e. tomorrow. So I will do better, but for now, I'm just, I mean, do you wanna see it since we're here? I mean, we might as well just, you probably wanna see it. You know, if they didn't make it like this, nobody would buy it, you know what I'm saying? If they just would make bad food nasty, we wouldn't have these issues. Next week, it sees a new week. It's a new day. I have high hopes for me, and I hope you all have high hopes for me too. So, it's kind of late. I'm not going to tell you what time it is, but it is a little late. But I'm up doing the last few edits for episode one that goes live tomorrow. I'm really excited, and I hope you guys enjoy G Weekly as much as I'm enjoying recording this side of me for you. If you enjoyed, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Do all of that fun stuff so I know that you're enjoying it. And um, if you made it this far, comment below your favorite cheat meal. Since I went and destroyed every bit of my healthiness with that pizza on tonight. Go ahead and share your favorite cheat meal so I don't feel so horrible. I hope you guys check back in next week for episode two. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.